Salut or new video to explain how the plants and temperature work. So as you may no have noticed on uh, Mundicraft 4, there will be a uh, temperature for each crops, uh, making them uh, more or more easier or uh, less easier to grow uh, depending on the temperature of the biome. Biome, for example. Uh, if I check the temperature where, where I am here, I'm, if it wants, in a flower forest and it's uh, uh, 17 degrees. And if I switch biome, biome and go in uh, an ocean, ocean, the temperature is lower. So you can see the temperature with slash temperature and you can also see uh, all the information about the temperature so actually the temperature of the biome and of the block i'm standing on is uh, 12, 12. Uh, we have some random temperature mod modifier so sometimes it's a bit cooler some sometimes it's a bit hotter it depends of the time it's random uh, there's a modifier who's uh, linked to the sun light uh, actually it's uh, or the beginning or the end of the day so it's uh, positive but uh, uh, far from the five who's the max uh, day night uh, temperature modifier uh, actually there is no rain or no storm so uh, no weather temperature modifier uh, we're uh, in I Ireland actually so the temperature is a bit cooler than if we were in Sa Sahara and uh, currently the season temperature is uh, set to zero it will be added in uh, next update and the underblock temperature modifier is a new thing from the update uh, of today uh, actually I, I'm on a grass so it has no impact but it's a way to improve uh, to modify the temperature of your crops uh, without changing your biome whose can be a bit complicated so for example if I have a tropical plant as su su sugarcane I may not be able to grow it in Ireland for example in the ocean biome the temperature is currently too low uh, so that the crops can be placed it's too cold for this plant to survive here so the if i manage to place it it will break if the the weather the temperature go down but in the for, for flower forest the temperature is a bit better so i can place it but it won't grow before 28 de degrees Celsius so I will need more to grow some uh, sugarcane if I do it for the wheat for example it can grow because the temperature is okay all the information about uh, temperature can be seen in temperature and some option for example I can check the information for the wheat and it say uh, currently it's uh, a bit an um, ugly print uh, we will do it better it's a uh, the plugin is still in beta so the temperature to survive is minus 20 if we go under that uh, the crops will break uh, it will grow if the temperature is over three and it also have some uh, ideal temperature uh, between 10 and 22 if the temperature is between these two values the crops will grow two times faster than in vanilla while if it's uh, between survive and grow min or max it won't survive it won't uh, grow yeah so oh so we have rain so i can show you the difference in temperature we're at eight and the tail say that uh, rain uh, add a minus two to the temperature and it's night so actually the temperature is minus 3.5 okay so we see the basic the global Id idea is that the crops can grow in location where they have enough uh, heat 
or cold to survive and if you manage to have the the right temperature your crops will grow faster than in vanilla minecraft and if you don't your crops might never grow so basically we can add some blocks to edit the temperature without switching bio uh, for example the sugarcane uh, so the sugarcane can be can't be placed currently because we're at seven and we need at least ten if i try on the block of grass who has a snow block under it i can't and the snow block actually reduced the temperature from 10 so uh, it, it's not a good idea at all for sugarcane that's a, a cold uh, a hot country plants but if I do it like for example the hay ball it will work because the hay ball imagine that it's mixed with the grass it protects the the roots from the cold of the winter so uh, the plant can be placed it won't grow because we don't have uh, uh, 28 in uh, temperature another solution could be to use a glass block to do a greenhouse so this will i will time this won't work uh, in uh, in night as you can see and if we say that time is now day and let's clear the weather it will help then I can place it because we're at uh, uh, 17 degrees while without the the greenhouse effect so without a glass block on anywhere it can be there it can be it can be really really high if you want so that you can build uh, any anything uh, the sugar cane won't grow and have a lower temperature some biome um, most biome have a temperature uh, tem a sun temperature of uh, 5 so you can increase to 10 with with the glass block if you are in a savanna for example or in a desert it's 10 so you can increase to 20 with um, glass block so you've seen this uh, technique uh, the the snow still uh, cold too much the the grass who's on top uh, and if we try with the lava actually it didn't display a warning message because the temperature of the block is over the minimal temperature for it to grow so i can check it uh, we're at uh, 37 degrees really nice and if i check temperature info sugarcane i can see that uh, I should be between uh, 38 and 15 to have the best temperature so I'm really close so it won't grow two times faster but 1.9 or something like that okay so we see the blocks there's another effect if your uh, crops are underground basically usually they grow uh, they, they, they don't have the sunlight so actually we have uh, the sunlight who's going there and uh, I think we, we can see it uh, somewhere here yeah cl client lie sky for 10 15 14 okay and if I place a block here then the sunlight is zero so the temperature here is slower if I show the detail you will see it um, it's a zero we, we have no impact from the day or night uh, or the sun and we have a, a lower temperature that, than before the only crops that grow faster under the ground than exposed to the daylight is the mushroom the boss mushroom so if you need to grow mushroom uh, make it in a, in a cave it will be more efficient than growing them exposed to daylight i've shown only for sugarcane but if i got uh, um yeah 
this thing, I can grow uh, any crops and it will have the same uh, behavior. For example, on the snow, currently we're at 18 and here, oh, I'm think, I think I'm one block too high. That's why if I, oh, whoa. if I, uh, let me test please. No, so, yeah, okay. So I think, oh yeah, because the, the block is a bit too, uh, a bit, I, I was on this block to test the temperature, but well, you can see it by placing the, the crops, it will say okay or not okay. Uh, if I want to try the watermelon, who's also as the sugarcane, an exotic plant, it will say, oh, no, 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 that's too low. And that's good, but not enough. And here it should be better. Right, we have no warning message. Okay, uh, that's all. If uh, there is major change, I will do a new video about it. I hope you guys uh, enjoy this format of sharing the update. Let me know. If you have any question, you can ask them in commenter, in the commentary section of the YouTube video or in a question in the Mundicraft Discord.